Hi, this is Kiara from Pencil, and welcome to today's tutorial on how to use reactions in pencil spaces. So when you are in whiteboard mode, to use reactions, you are going to go to the three dots at the bottom of your participant box and click on it. And then you will find reactions and select that. And you'll be shown all the reactions you can use on the call. So for example, let's say I want to give a thumbs up and your reaction will appear in the corner of your participant box. As a host, if I wanted to disable participants from using reactions, I would follow the same process. I would click the three dots, I would be taken to reactions, and I would click the eye icon on the top of this reaction box. And this will disable emotes. So now participants will not be able to use reactions. Pencil also has the option of automatic gesture recognition. So this will allow you to gesture the reaction you want to present in the corner of your participant box and it will appear without needing to click on the reaction. So in order to turn this on, you would go to the three dots again. You would click enable automatic gesture recognitions. And now I can gesture on my screen and the emote will automatically appear on the top corner of my screen instead of having to click directly on the reaction. When in gallery mode, a similar process applies. I'm going to go to the bottom bar of my screen and click the reactions button. And I will be displayed all the reactions I can use on the call. And it again will appear in the corner of my screen. The same goes for disabling participants from using emotes, as well as enabling and disabling automatic gesture recognition. As you can see, automatic gesture recognition and emotes are also available in gallery mode. It is important to note that if you do want to use automatic gesture recognition, your camera does have to be on and you do have to ensure that Pencil Spaces has access to your camera by clicking the lock button at the top left corner of your screen. Thank you for watching today's tutorial. I hope you found it helpful. If you do need any further assistance, feel free to click the help button at the top right corner of your screen.